a day in the life of a New York girl. Woke up in the morning and gave my dog some belly wraps with my foot because he has a little feet fetish and I accept him as he is. Took him to a little morning walk and prepared myself mentally as I know tonight is the Halloween parade and it gets really busy in the village. Don't get me wrong, I love the parade, it's just impossible to get in and out of my apartment for a few hours, not to mention walk a little dog. Came back home and gave him a few puffs from his inhaler. It really helps with his coughing issues, which happens because of his heart disease. I know it look intense, but other than this treatment routine, he's a pretty happy and relaxed here he gets his breakfast and i got myself coffee before i'm falling asleep first coffee of the day it was 8 30 then did some work and more work and more work i had a call with a client at 11 and i also did some editing for my personal channels and for another client and i still have a pretty long day ahead because i'm finalizing plans for november for my clients i was hoping to clean and organize my apartment yesterday which didn't happen it looks like a mess so i did it today really quickly just organized some of it folded some clothes and vacuum then i had to do a quick walk for joy and pick up a package from ups and run back home to do more work did more work gave joy's afternoon treat which is a carrot his favorite and made myself a smoothie gave joy another carrot hopped on a quick five minute work call finished up some things regarding this call and headed up to my next adventure i had to go down to soho to tory borch to do an exchange for a bag that i purchased three years ago and it was past its warranty but i came to the boutique last week hoping to get a quote for a repair they come with thank you and the wonderful store associate brian checked with alterations yes. and called me back to let me know they're doing an exchange and giving me a new bag thank you so much i ran to the restroom and continued with my day at this point of the day i still had so much to do i had a few more hours of work i wanted to do a quick workout and finish early enough to start getting ready for a Halloween. Stop real quick to enjoy New York. And so should you because this is what makes New York, New York. <laughs> Made it on time last minute for yoga class and walked back home to get ready for Halloween. On my way back home, I saw all the people wearing costumes and all the kids coming back from trick or treat, which was very cute and just enjoyed the Halloween scenery in the most amazing and my favorite city in the entire world. Stay tuned for part two to see what costume I chose for this year for Halloween.